match referee for today is Rubiel Vasquez. A video assistant referee will be Soren Stoika. It is the host Charlotte FC who get us in the way, attacking from right to left. And the ladder immediately playing a long ball forward, intercepted by Byrne. First real glimmer of a look for Inter Miami. And Abada going the other way. Rock foot to defender, and now Griffson takes him down. That was reckless from the center back. Yeah. Our side just has to go to ground. He'll accept the yellow card. But both sides, this is where they can be at their best. Vargas. Ajiman trying to make the run behind. Kristoff going with him. Ajiman gets position. Wait for the center back. And a big save from Callender. Well, that was super center forward play. Ability to hold up play. Just a really good feat for the size of body that he is. And, and this is an excellent turn just to get a little bit of separation. Catches Kristoff off. And, and that's a big time save from Drake Callender. Last second. Gets himself down. Big hand to be able to keep that. We got. Kramaski, Alba on the overlap, finds him, Alba with the cross, and uh, what was that expected, Goldstone, but doesn't matter, does it? Into Miami strike in an instant, Robert Taylor finding space, and the best move of the match. Touching out that back line, it's a big ball to the far side, then you get the overlapping run, that draws the defender, and then just the marking, lose their mark, marking space instead of the player, it's just an easy tap in, in the end. For Taylor just makes good contact with the ball, comes through, taps it into the back of the net, and all of a sudden it's 1-0 for Inter Miami away from home. Nice touch by Bronico, good run by Abada, goes down right on the edge, no whistle. Hajiman chucks to go for goal, off the post! So close to a leveler for Charlotte. The recovery run defensively to help back. Not forcing the save. There's an initial a shot. The sharing of the ball, we've talked about that already throughout this first half, and utilizing the whip. Good strength from Ajima. He's in, he's got a clear line to go. He's gonna open up and score! If anybody was gonna break through against Inter Miami, it was this man. He has been red hot so far, and Ajima gets his deserved goal. 1-1. One, one. Easy throw in, and Adjuman wins his 1v1 battle again. Savi Las gets spun, and just the composure, you can see him slowing himself down, seeing where Drake Callender's gonna go, opens up his body, enough pace, enough bend on that ball just to tuck it in. Does look like Drake Callender gets a little something on it, he does. This is why I would never be a referee, or <laughs> a video assistant <laughs> referee. Point. He's gonna go have a look at it. Yeah. So, <laughs> Adjuman's body language, he looked over it. The center back has gotten beat. Higher field I think fair game on this one and Ajiman still a ton of work to do after review the decision in the field stands goal they got really good football in from Inter Miami cross in and the way waiting still an opportunity and that one flashes through Jordi Alba head and hands after missing that one a smile on his face because he can't believe it typically just tucks those away, but this is where Inter Miami has been so good, especially in the last three games. Just those little balls in behind, darting run, difficult to be tracked, lands to Jordan in an excellent position. It makes good contact. You see it immediately falls to his knees. Can't believe his luck. Havana. Havana trying to open up on his left, looking for the return. Almost gets it. Ajiman! I think he toe put to that just to get it off so quickly. Alba, again, staying at the edge. Bright staying all the way back. Gressel whipped in delivery. Alfonso was climbing for it. Not fully clear. That's a big save. Gomez caught it well. Delina saved it with his foot, I think. Alba with the cross, and that should be routine for the goalkeeper. The ball out wide. A little bit of space here for Gressel. Tries to play that through. Kramaski! He's got the final touch! And Inter Miami are ahead late on! What a ball that was from Gressel! That Gressel has just kept himself wide to be able to buy himself time. Excellent first touch just to be able to cushion, get his head up. But my goodness, what a ball that is. Driven behind the back line. Kramaski goes ground. Just a tap in in the end. He does the rest. But the positioning initially from Gressel to keep himself wide, give himself that time. But what a ball.
Busquets as well with the ball out wide. 